it looks like an actual hospital machine. <laughs> and not all of the machines here do. So that's, uh, that's something. Hello everybody and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. I am Twinkly Tanya and we are still in Tumble trying to um, get our first star basically. Um, I have paused the game because there is a one person waiting for a deluxe clinic and there's one person waiting for a pan's lab so we will build those to begin with. And maybe in this episode we could actually earn the first star because we need to cure 20 more patients and we need to have a thermal comfort of 60% and that is very easy to obtain actually. That second thing, uh, the curing 20 patients, I don't know. <laughs> uh, let's see how fast that goes. The treatment rooms would help greatly, <laughs> obviously. Um, do we want small rooms or bigger ones? I'm not sure. Maybe small ones. It is. This is such a small hospital. <clears throat> um, but it's a really, really large room. It's fine. We will go for a small, uh, cozy <laughs> room for this one. Let's do it this way. You know what? Uh, oh, well, that's too small, though. <laughs> um, okay. I don't know if this is too, too small. Maybe the room is too small. I'm not sure. We need to put a radiator in there. We can fit there. I want a coffee maker. Sure. Uh, I also want a plant at the very least. Yeah, see, I thought so. So let's uh, move this thing actually like so. Then a little bit more fits in there. An extinguisher. We definitely need one. And that might be it. Well, I do want a chair as well. If we can, <laughs> we can put it here. Yes. Okay. Now we can uh, add some things for prestige. Some uh, pyramid, uh, some posters, I meant. <laughs> Not some pyramids. Uh, wait, this is the deluxe one right so we need a light-headed poster right over here <laughs> maybe we can just put light-headed posters all over this room oh we can have a certificate over here and I don't know maybe just some some light-headed posters can I put the anatomy model somewhere maybe over here um, we could that all right the Rorschach poster that's actually a pretty nice poster I like it over there and maybe maybe a notice board or something we cannot go to prestige level four until we uh, unless we really cramp the room with stuff I don't want that so let's do this and on the other side possibly uh, I'm not really sure it's a bit weird. Not okay. Maybe not at the other side. Maybe just next to it. We can have the uh, what's it called again? Pan's lab. Yes. I haven't encountered any clowns yet, so I'm not sure if we need one. Oh, this one needs to be bigger. Right. I forgot about that. Uh, then we could actually make the deluxe clinic a little bit bigger as well, I suppose. All right, bam. <laughs> the big bin. Over there, the extinguisher. All right. Because now there's this really large area over here. We could um, put a news agent there. We already have two, um, two assistants. And we don't really need two, I think at this point so that might be an option i might do that i'm not really sure though mm, let's have the plant in the corner maybe one over here as well and the chair obviously <laughs> i simply must have a chair 
All right. This is all we need. We want to make it pretty as well, right? Let's have a clown poster as well. <laughs> all these posters that we can put here. Certificate as well. Oh, maybe over here. And uh, what else? I don't want to put the same posters in every room, but <laughs> I think I just have to. I like that. Oh, we almost have prestige level four though. We can have an anatomy model as well. Like that. Just between the posters, like that. We could have a second one. <laughs> sure, why not? Uh, what else? What else? A sweet dispenser? Can we? Is it possible? Does it still fit somewhere? I don't think so. Ooh, it does. Nice. Uh, oh no. It doesn't, because then we cannot water the plant anymore. Hmm. We could put it here. In front of the window. It's a bit weird, but it will work. What else, though? More posters. Ah. <sighs> I don't want to cram this, the place with posters. We could have another certificate here and there. Sure. <laughs> this is a very certified nurse. Ah, I wish we could put something above the fire extinguisher. Just doesn't make sense if we can't. Okay, prestige level four. There we go. Um, I think I do want to make this room a little bit bigger though. No, nope. <laughs> see, I cannot even click the room properly. <laughs> Because it's so small. Okay, let's make it a little bit bigger then. Like so. Let's move the door. Maybe over here. Uh, okay, let's move this thing a little bit. And of course, all the things that need to be against a wall, like posters. <laughs> all right. This, this works. Cool. We can resume the game. Uh, is it working? <laughs> yes. Okay, just checking. Maybe we can have some toilets here? I don't know. Um, rooms. I mean, there's also still some... Um, some rooms that we haven't built yet. A lot of rooms that we haven't built yet, actually. We could have a training room there. Or more research. Uh, not research, more um, di diagnosis areas. Uh, these are all um, treatment rooms. We could also move the fracture board here. There's a little bit more space over here, I suppose, but... I don't know, we could have a mega scan. How much uh, room do we need? Four by four. One, two, three, four. And there's one, two. Hmm. Oh, we could put toilets next to it. <laughs> that, that doesn't seem safe, what they are doing there. <laughs> I'm just going to put a mega scan here, why not? Just because we can. I don't think that we ever built this, though. We we researched it, but I don't think we actually built it in the previous hospital, did we? Hmm. I have seen a few pictures of it from um, in uh, in some Two Point Hospital Facebook group, so I have seen the machine. So I'm not. I'm not entirely sure if I've only seen the machine on pictures or if I have actually built it myself already. I don't think I have built it myself though. I cannot. I cannot remember seeing it in action. Also, it looks quite impressive though. <laughs> it looks like an actual hospital machine. <laughs> 
and not all of the machines here do. So that's uh, that's something. Oh wait, this server though doesn't that also produce heat? Uh, I it might. Does it say no? Hmm. Uh, oh, I already have one of those. Sure. Let's have an anatomy model somewhere. Maybe next to the plant. Mm -hmm. Can they still reach the fire extinguisher though? Hmm. I think they can. It doesn't really say that they can't. Uh, oh, sure, maybe a light heavy poster there. go. I don't think we can get it up to level 4 though. <laughs> uh, we might, I don't know. We need something, something better. <clears throat> I could actually unlock the gold star award right now. You know what, let's do it. I have heard that this is a pretty amazing uh, thing for prestige oh yeah it works quite well actually okay so we can have two yay okay that was actually a good call the healthcare branch of the orb like that has launched a new campaign called real doctors mm -hmm. who needs them oh we could also have a training room over here training rooms don't need to be that big actually items let's give them some benches and some drinks right like so uh, it fits here <laughs> and the snacks machine fits over here perfect let's have some bins like so and something against boredom I'm usually very good at that but <laughs> I keep forgetting it now I don't know why because the hospital is so incredibly small I think <laughs> so that's why I keep forgetting to put these in uh, and of course, oh, I don't have room now for a radiator. <laughs> no, we do need one though. You know what? Let's get rid of this thing because uh, there's not so many people here. Actually, this is better, and uh, maybe one near the entrance as well. Yes, that's that's better, and also one here. Amazing. Okay, so the thermal comfort level is great now. We only need to cure a few patients. Just a few. I think we could actually manage that in this episode. Wouldn't that be great? The cues are okay. Um, nothing terrible is happening. So, um, let's probably build a training room. Because uh, we had some staff that wanted to be trained. This is oh, this is too small. <laughs> okay, we we cannot. I thought we could have a super tiny one, but we can't. That's fine though. We can still have one. Uh, we just need to adjust the plan a little bit and put it here. Uh, yeah, it can be a very small one. <clears throat> oh, this is not super small even. But this is fine. Uh, we will have the door here. So that we can have uh, the teacher over there. Ah, it is quite small, but it's fine. Can we have three, though, next to each other? That would be great if we could. Yes, we can. Three students. Alright, let's have some bookcases. Encyclopedia bookcase as well. Ah, that looks amazing. It looks like a proper classroom. Filing cabinet for the teacher. And of course we need a bin. We don't need a fire extinguisher here. <laughs> Let's give them a hand sanitizer though. And a radiator. Maybe even two. Mm, maybe if I put it here it will be enough, I think. Also, can we have a coffee maker? Yes. Ah, 
Amazing. We don't have plants yet, though. Oh, this looks amazing. This is a nice, cozy... Uh, oh, wait. Obviously, we can have some posters to, um, to up to the prestige. And maybe we have even those pesky viruses in the system. Am I too optimistic, wait. then? No, my producer's telling me we, we could have one here in it's the middle. One of those days. Sure. I have no idea what song will play next, but I hope it's a good one. <clears throat> Let's have a clown poster. Let's have one of all the diseases so that they can, uh, you know, see what it entails. Also this. Why is this not working? Okay, we can have it there. That's a little bit close to the coffee machine, though. This is better. Maybe the other side as well? Can we have another poster? Maybe this one. Yes, and this one as well. Ah, amazing. This looks like a perfect, uh, a perfect classroom actually. And he has some uh, more awards over here. Ooh. I am tempted now <laughs> to put them everywhere, to just uh, get it to level five. Oh, it works great. Uh, I wish I, I could have two over here as well. I could have one over here. <laughs> we will have it. Okay, now I really need uh, another one. Right? There we go. Prestige level five. <laughs> All right. Cool. Uh, you need to get treated immediately okay uh, I think we need some more staff doctors mostly um, no higher <laughs> what's this this is a researcher uh, that is also nice this is a treatment doctor oh I really like the researcher though Radiology, I will hire you um, just because, yeah, and you can actually work in the in this one. Okay, let's monitor some patients over here because this is not going well. Um, someone is almost dying in the toilet. That's not good. Uh, what is with you? Lycanthropy. But are you already? Yes, you are queuing. Okay, that's that's good. Uh, you are getting treated, I suppose? I think so. Treatment in progress. Yes. Alright. Well then, I cannot do very many things then. <laughs> Special report. Oh, we didn't cure enough. Only two. Oh, dear. I should have monitored them. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot to check. That's not good at all. Okay. Maybe we could have, uh, because th there's some cues here right now. We could have some more diagnostic uh, diagnostic rooms. Promote three staff. Uh, sure, <laughs> I accept. I cannot promote them unless they are uh, ready, though. We, we didn't need a psychiatry room up until now, though. Oh, look. We have our first star. Congratulations. You're doing a smashing job of gluing back together all of those witless activity bandits. I've never seen the appeal of pursuits al fresco myself. Land should be owned and profited from, not used as a venue for wanton perambulation. Uh, continue with your uh, osteological upkeep for more rewards, or go elsewhere and expand your organization. So we could go to Flemington right now, and we have a small radiator. That is actually pretty neat. I do want to... Uh, oh, we have a uh, Kurosh as well. That's nice. I want to continue here, actually. Um, because I... I just... I, I want to go for the second star as well. And I don't feel that our hospital is... Is um, up to speed enough uh, for it to be running on its own. Also, we probably... Before we build any room, we should probably put some more benches over here. Because people are standing. And that's not nice when you're sick. Absolutely not. Uh, we can have a fourth one over here. I really don't like the the waiting rooms like that, but hey, it's uh, it's all we can do here. <laughs> it's fine. 
Okay, uh, there is a large space over here, so I want to, uh, not hire, <laughs> I want to build another room. Cardiology we could do, mm, fluid analysis. I, I tend to believe that the more expensive the room gets, the better diagnosis it can give. <laughs> this is high-tech diagnosis, excellent for spotting items lost inside of people. Let's see. If we can actually build it here. We can. Let's do it then. Um, it will block a window this way. I don't like that. So let's put it on this wall. Yeah. All the way. Like so. It is quite small. Though. <laughs> It actually needs to be bigger. That would that would have been better, but it's fine. We will manage. Where can we put the server, though? <laughs> I want one, <laughs> just because it's expensive and uh, I don't know. I, I don't even know what it does. They also don't know what it does. Plus one percent research power. That was it. Okay. Hand sanitizer. Yes, we can, we can have one. Radiator. We need a radiator. I don't think we can put in a coffee maker here, though. So, <laughs> I am sorry, but... Oh, we can. Yes. Can we also put in a chair? It's getting really cramped. I don't think we can. Mm. Maybe we can put this a little bit... Yes. Now, no, it, it doesn't fit. It doesn't fit. Okay, too bad. It would fit if we didn't have the. Um... Oh, we can fit it here. Amazing. Okay. Now, uh, let's see if we can have some plans. <laughs> like at least, like just one would be great. Like so. <laughs> That's a little bit of a weird position, but. This will do, and um, I will go for the gold star ward first, over here. Pocket watches are a thing of the past. Like so. I want prestige level four. I don't want only gold star wards though. I want some other posters too. Um, or a gold star ward is not necessarily really a poster, I, I think. Clown poster. There we go. Prestige level four. We did it. Um, oh no. No, no, <laughs> no. I just, I just built another room. <laughs> oh dear. The roof fell down. <laughs> the roof literally fell down. Um, wow. With wires and everything. <laughs> That's not good. Also, we have a ghost roaming around uh, the hallways there. Yikes. And we have a patient almost dying. Okay, but you're getting treated. Well, you should be first, though. Okay. Um, let's manage our staff a little bit. Because uh, I have the feeling that we can do that better. Because we, we are not managing them at all at this point. So, <laughs> That's not good. Okay, who should do the diagnosis? Uh, you, probably. And you. You should do radiology and research, basically. Um, X-ray. I don't want all of these people to be working in treatment. Only Bernard can work in treatment, okay? And you cannot do diagnosis. You're, on, you're our treatment doctor, basically. Then we have one researcher that, uh, uh, and you can also be the only one allowed in the mega scan, actually, because yes, qualified in radiology. Uh, it's also the only one who can can actually do it. X-ray, they can do this though, but I need more doctors. I definitely do not have enough <laughs> nurses. So we have you. Um, you should do pharmacy. 
Oh dear. Uh, I mean, we, we don't have all these things, but we have a fracture ward. Um, okay, I, I, need, I need some more nurses, I think. Um, although it doesn't say. Apparently they are doing their job just fine, but I don't know. I want to hire uh, some more doctors, though. This one has um, psychiatric qualities. Motivated. Oh, cheese for brain, so we cannot really train him fast. Uh, or her. Grain. <laughs> I'm not really sure. I think, I think she's a lady. Grain. Jake Asparagus. That's a nice name, but you're unmotivated. Charming one-handed backhand. Okay, and we can shape you to our desire. Let's do that, actually. Let's just train you immediately. Um, into... <laughs> what do we want to train you in? Maybe we want to make you a really great GP. And there was one other doctor. Oh, he's not ready for training, though, I think. Um, too bad. Okay, well, well, we'll just start with you, then. Trainers available. Oh, because this one also... Uh, it was this one that I thought of, but um, she already has GP1, actually. Um, we will pay for a guest trainer. I don't We're want to lose any more doctors. There we go. Promote you. Promote you. And a fracture emergency. Yes, let's, let's do that. All right, because we do need to cure 100 patients to get the second star, and that is really a lot. <laughs> All right. uh, this is getting a problem over here, though. Let's see. We can probably send some people for treatment, like you, for example. So, let's see. Patients. Uh, health. I want to see the people with the lowest health. Send you for treatment. And you have your appointment there. That is great. A diagnosis required. Uh, I do want to send you for treatment, actually. <laughs> diagnosis in progress, though. So after that, we should, um, we should click sending to treatment immediately. Oh, but this is our chance, though. We can see how this thing works now. <laughs> That's quite... Uh, High tech. Whoops. Great. All right. Uh, send you for treatment then, can we? Yes. Send for treatment. Okay. Some more patients though. This one is uh, almost dead. <laughs> send for treatment. And uh, go first in queue. I hope we... We manage. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Oh, yes. We got another one. We got most prestigious hospital. Amazing. And uh, Hannibal, Hannibal Boff is the nurse of the year. And Jamie Lynn Eruption. <laughs> this name, though. Doctor of the year. So Jamie Lynn and Hannibal. All right. Let's, uh, let's give you a raise. You deserved it. Uh, where are you? Hannibal Boff is here. Let's make you a little bit happier. We can make you super duper happy, I think. There we go. And... Um, who was it? Jamie Lynn Eruption. You can be happy. No, this is just normal happy. Can we make you super happy? Uh, not sure. This is quite a lot of money. I will just do it. <laughs> Okay. Send you for treatment. Oh, you are going for treatment. Okay, that's fine. Let's uh, let's check the patients again. There's a few people <laughs> almost dying here. Appointment in the ward. Appointment in the pharmacy. All right. Also an appointment. Appointment GP's office. Well, uh, send you for treatment. Yes. Wow, the tenth in line. No, send for treatment. Maintenance announcement. Okay. Will full. Send for treatment as well. 
first bridge out on small you as well after being struck by I wish we we didn't have to do this manually really but more news coming up I mean, as as in an actual hospital, I suppose they also need to do this manually, <laughs> kind of. But maybe we could just have an option, like if the diagnosis is, is sure or 90% sure, then you don't have to go back to the GP's office and you can just go to treatment. Because it just doesn't make sense that they are holding up our GPs, right? Alright, I think that we have kind of solve it because these people all, all still need a diagnosis maybe we can check the first ones in line again monobrow appointment ward health low yeah i know <laughs> diagnosis in progress no i don't want that i i also don't want to send them home though feeling too cold why is there a room without without a um what is it? <laughs> uh, let's see. Temperature. It looks okay. Well, okay. In the hallway, it is a little bit cold, though. And I do think I have... No, I don't have benches there. But, you know what? It's fine. We can, we can put some radiators over there. I'm not against that. Like so. And like so. And maybe in the corner over here as well. Is this better then? Or was it in the ward, maybe? Maybe uh, I could have the small radiator. I unlocked it. Or do I still need to pay for it? No, okay. Maybe some small one fits here? Doesn't. <laughs> Too bad. Um, hmm. I mean, I can put them in the middle of the room, but it looks so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Just having a small radiator over here. Looks really weird. You could even have one over here. <laughs> Just to make the patient happy. Um, well. I s oh no, that is too hot though. Okay. No, pick it up. That's not good either. Okay. Well... The rest of the hospital seems fine to me. There's still long queues over there though. I don't want that. Send you for treatment. Okay. Uh, Charlotte, Charlotte Lagrotte has gained lots of experience and she wants training. Okay, not now. Um, but this might mean that the training room is available again. There's so much we could do with this place. A few more plants, a nice picture, some art, maybe even clean up that vomit. Hospital attractiveness of 70%. Sure, except. How much do we have right now? Uh, also, we have we had a health minister visit that I completely missed. <laughs> um, the fracture patients, I again did not really monitor. <laughs> so I really hope that we, uh, that we cured them. <laughs> um... We have a hospital attractiveness of 66. We can uh, make it nicer, I suppose. Just put some plans in. Oh no, two out of five. That's not good. Also, it's really hot in here. Why? I have too many radiators over there. I should put one maybe over here. No, now it's cold over there. Wait, <laughs> I didn't want to do that. This is better, I think. Okay, let's make it more attractive. Um, in the hallways, basically. Mostly, I think. To the owner of the bluish car, your car is being taken for Cuban. Which car? They... A bluish car for Cuban. There's no cars here. They all come by, by a helicopter. What is she news, talking about? Minister for Health, Tarquin Foxbridge, visiting <laughs> some local hospitals. The tireless politician was making sure yeah, it, it doesn't look attractive at all. Usually I put plans so everywhere. <laughs> radio, I but uh, usually I spend so much time making these uh, these areas look nice. Oh, it would be so nice if we could put the plant here. Come on. Um, but right now... I, <laughs> I, I didn't because um, it just didn't really make sense. Because there's no room. 
for stuff like that. All right. Uh, we we did succeed already, but now I, I I just want to make it even more attractive because this this really looks horrible. Okay, this is uh, kind of better. I think we could we could have some plants near the entrance, like so. Okay, cool. The publicity updates. Tar Tarquin Foxbridge has sent us a handwritten note. Oh, it was Tarquin who who was visiting us. We could have seen. A Tarquin in person. He has sent us a handwritten note following his visit to the hospital. I'm thrilled to see that you've succeeded in executing my 117 step plan for ideal healthcare. What an excellent plan it was. Great. And Green Bubble is, uh, is very happy with us because we succeeded in making the hospital a little bit more attractive. Um, it's still not really nice in this hallway though. Let's see if we can put some more plants over there. Maybe the other plant. The plant, <laughs> basically. Oh, I saw a clown. That means that we need another treatment room as well. Mm, that's a door. We cannot put a plant in front of the door. <laughs> But we can put plants here. Uh, there's just this little area over here that is not super great. But overall it is better, at the very least. Yeah, maybe maybe a plant over there as well. Just to make it look a little bit nicer. Maybe even in the... Uh, in, in this room. The reception room wasn't nice either. Okay, cool. Uh, we definitely need to fix our GPQs, <laughs> though. So, uh, oh god, look at that. <laughs> not to have dark thoughts. Well, they can. <laughs> I'm, I'm not opposed to that. Uh, they can have all the thoughts that they want, <laughs> actually. Okay, promote. So, in the next episode, we definitely need to fix this um, GPQ problem. And uh, we need to build a clown clinic. Because I just saw a clown wandering around. So we, uh, we need one very soon. But we will do that in the next episode. If you want to see that, then make sure that you're subscribed. And uh, that you hit the notification bell so you won't miss it. Yes, I know that there's a queue inside GP's office. Uh, we will fix that later in the next episode. I will see you there. Have an amazing, lovely day.